welcome to the holiday lunch week. We are running super late, so I'm not gonna keep it too cute right now. Um, I, as much fun as I wanna have this week with them, I do wanna make sure that they actually get food that they're gonna eat for lunch. So I try to keep that in mind and actually use stuff that they already eat. So um, we started with bagels. So these are like little, you know, reindeer bagels, like little Rudolph bagels. So I just popped some eyes on there. Like this is Nala's, hers has peanut butter like it normally does. A couple of pretzels in there for ears. And then I put one little red M&M in there. Or well, it's like a little candy coated thing. It's not actually an M&M. It's made by Hershey's which might make m ms actually. All right, we're off topic. So I did the same thing for Jaden, um, except his has the pumpkin spice cream cheese. And then I made, um, and then I made for their veggie, they're taking pea pods like they normally do, except I lined them up on a toothpick and then I cut the edges off of these ones. And then we cut out a piece of cheese, some stars and stuff. And then I added some extra ones because I, again, I want them to actually eat. So there's a few extra ones in here with just kind of some stars floating around. And then um, again, another star and tree for Nala. And then these are the little Santa hats. There's a lot of variations of these, but I want them again to actually have some fruit to eat. So I threw the grapes on there. Even though I think they look better with the banana, but the banana would probably brown and my kids are just not as keen on eating brown bananas. So you might see some varieties of these coming pretty soon. Um, but today, this is what we're doing for our fruit and veggie. And then the kids are also gonna take little cotton candy, um, what are these called? Danimals? And these are the little winter edition ones, so they have like little presents and they're dressed like Santa and stuff. And same goes for their water. I once again picked up like the winter editions of the Pure Life waters. So they're taking flavored waters, and a lot of you ask me, why don't you just send them with regular water? I do send them with regular water every single day. It's inside of their backpack. They have it with them at their desk all day long. The reason that they don't drink their drinks during lunch is because they run out of time. So it's not that they don't like them, because a lot of times they come home and have them um, as soon as they get home. It's just that they don't have time to do that, and I'd rather they eat the food than drink the water at lunch, because they have water throughout the day. So then these I picked up at Target, and it was like five bucks maybe for a whole pack of them. And this is what it looks like when it's actually closed but I want to show you what it looks like when it's full and it's full of pirate booty yeah I said yours is peanut butter and no, this is his He's yeah peanut butter. no his has pumpkin spice in it uh, I tasted it it's oh you're right they're reversed right now okay <laughs> Nala was writing me messages on a board um anyway this has um <laughs> pirate booty inside of it. So that's gonna be part of their snack. And then um, the Danimal is also part of their snack. This is their lunch. So I did also give them a little chewy snow day gingerbread spice bar in here. So that is our lunch for the day. Nice. Um, we'll be doing this all week. So see you guys, welcome back. It is after school on Monday. The kids are actually outside playing right now. And I'm not sure where their snack bags are, um, but they did both say that they ate their lunch. So let's see how they did. I can only assume that they ate the snack. I don't know why they wouldn't. Just animals and uh, pirate booty. Look at Nala's thing. Look at this. Is this, what is this? Look at this. Do you see it? Okay, okay. There's no toothpick either, so now I'm a little worried. Um, and then this is also, um, we don't have to open it. This is also empty. She told me she ate all but, what did she say? Oh no, she said she ate everything. And then right as she was gonna drink this, they ran out of time, she had to zip it up. So she can have this with dinner or I can pack it again tomorrow. If she eats it with dinner, she can get a new one tomorrow and I know she's excited about that. Wait, there's not even any cheese in here. Guys, what? Wow, okay. So here's Jaden. This looks a little more normal. I, you know, my daughter's not really one to be sneaky and like throw food away, so I have to believe that she actually ate all that. Um, he left his stuff. But she doesn't even have the toothpicks, so, hmm. We'll have to get to the bottom of that one, guys. Um, he left a couple, but he, oh, and he doesn't like Munster. He likes Gouda. I tried to lie this morning and tell him it was Gouda, being a bad mom. Um, anyway, he left these four. I can actually probably just repack these because they're perfectly fine. He didn't even try to eat them. And then he ate about half, no, a little more than half of his bagel. He's not huge on bagels. He's really not huge on sandwiches, like, it's hard to find something for that kid to eat. Tomorrow I think we're gonna do cracker-based stuff, so he'll probably like that. Um, yeah, he ate about half of it. This was the maple, why did it turn green? He must have had marker on his hand while he was eating. This is the um, maple French toast bagels, and they're really enjoying them. Somebody asked me if I toast them. I don't toast them. I've never toasted them for them, so like I'm not gonna start now because that's just one added step that is unnecessary. I personally prefer an untoasted bagel, so I can only assume that my spawn 
would also like that. He also barely ate any of this, but I guess that's because he didn't eat that many. And then again, he left his whole water. So, um, that's it. That was that was pretty successful. Like like I said, guys, I'm gonna do my best to try to incorporate food that they actually eat, but I want to make it fun for you guys and fun for the kids. So, um, hopefully we can keep it up. And we'll see you guys tomorrow. Hey guys, welcome to Tuesday. Running a little bit behind as usual, so let's zippity doo da on through this, okay? Um, I'm using their, what are these called again? Good bins. I'm using their little good bins. You can probably tell lately that I've been a fan of these. They're just a perfect size for them. So we'll start with their snacks so that they can put them away. Um, I'm sending them with these little wintry themed animal crackers. And then also these juicy red apples and grapes. I meant to just get the apples, but apparently I got the ones that have grapes in it too. So um, this is what they're gonna take for snack. Go ahead and put these away, guys. There you go. If, if you want, the, the crackers won't fit. Um, and they, of course, are taking a full size water bottle as usual. And then for lunch today, this is Nala's. Um, Nala has crackers with a slice of pepperoni in between each one. And then I cut out little star-shaped cheese. Towards the end, the last couple have the scraps in it because there's really no sense in wasting the piece of cheese. Um, and then I gave her this little fun little like Christmas ring. I ordered this on Amazon. They're like rubbery. The whole thing is rubbery, so it's kind of interesting. I'm just gonna pop that in there and then we're gonna put the lid on top of that so that it doesn't get all over the place. I think I did that upside down. Um, I got adjusted so I don't break the cracker and then she's just gonna have cucumbers. I have a fun little veggie based um, Christmassy thing to do but we didn't do it today So maybe tomorrow and then she just asked for a toothpick So I sent her this little Merry Christmas one so she could eat and that okay I will give you one and then we're also doing just plain old strawberries today um, but to kind of jazz it up I put these edible snowflakes on it and these are from like I, I think they're made by Wilton or I don't know. I got them in just like the Christmassy area. That's not gonna fit, sweetie. Oh. It's not gonna fit. Um, I got them from the Christmassy area at Target. Anyway, these are just like little wafers. I don't know how they're gonna work out throughout the day, but I thought that would you know be cute. Jazz it up a little bit. Jaden's gonna have his snap peas again, and since he's having them again, I figured I'd make him another little tree. I threw a couple pieces of Gouda on there. Okay, the cheese that you like. So eat it this time. And then again, he has the uh, strawberries and snowflakes. Now he has another one. I don't know where it must have fallen. Um, but anyway, he also got a little ring <clears throat> to kind of keep it fun. He's got like a little elf. Huh? Yeah. And then um, he also has the crackers with cheese and pepperoni, but he has Gouda. Again, towards the end, I just threw the scraps in there because there's really no sense in wasting them. And then, um, of course, they're taking a happy, happy? Oh, happy holidays hilarious and then oh snap um, they're taking some water and then if they actually eat their food I'm sending them with a fun little treat this I also got at Target and these are the toffee crunch pretzels I thought those were just a little fun thing to add in there if you actually eat your food got it and the cheese everything oh uh, well this little container here I would like for you to eat this okay because I don't want you coming home hungry all right so we will see you guys after school oh Jaden also we got ranch eat these because of candy they said like candy. Yeah, I mean, one? what you want to do. No, not off of here. Anyway, we'll see you guys after school. All right, guys, it's after school, and let's see how the kids did. Nala said that her cucumbers were sour, which they kind of were. I tasted them this morning. They were kind of gross, and she said they were fine. So they said that the <laughs> snowflakes were kind of gross, <laughs> but they did eat the um, strawberries. To her credit, she at least ate half of them. They were very tart. I didn't like that. Uh, let's see how she did. It looks like she didn't eat any of the crackers, but you know what? The pepperoni made them soft. I wonder if that's why she didn't eat them. Hmm. At least she had all the pepperoni and cheese, though. And then she had whatever I put on the side of this and a little bit of water. And then... He did the same with his water. He said he didn't get time to eat his snack at all. He wasn't allowed to take it in or something. I'm not sure. And I'll eat hers though. And then, still gotta kind of get to the bottom of that. And for his lunch, he did pretty good, it looks like. He ate all the berries, most of that. Uh oh. This looks like a heavy stack in here, buddy. goodness can't open it what happened all that cutting for nothing 
Well, it looks like you ate about half of it. So maybe next time I'll do like half and then put something else in the other half. But again, this one feels like moist. So I was a little concerned about mixing them together. So um, if you guys are gonna do this, I suggest not mixing them together. <laughs> leave the stars, leave the stars and the, I mean the pepperoni and the cheese can go together, but don't mix it with the cheese because apparently a couple hours and it's just kind of gross. I wouldn't have eaten that either. But overall, not too bad guys. Welcome to Wednesday. So um, let's start off with the basics here. The kids are taking a flavored water. Nala has her little O-Snap water flavored with watermelon. Jaden has toast to the new year. And his has um, tropical punch in it today. We ran out of his normal one. And then uh, for their snack, the kids are each gonna take a little drinkable yogurt, a little wintry one. Um, Jaden keeps forgetting his snack bag, so, or his snack bag rather, so he just gets to take it in his hand. And they're also gonna get a chewy, snowy day um, gingerbread spice granola bar. So Nala does have her snack bag, so she gets to put hers, here you go babe, she gets to put her stuff in the bag. It's not a lot. Uh, maybe I'll give him one more thing. Um, okay, and then for lunch, we're gonna do, Nala, go ahead and put your snack bag stuff in your backpack, you too, JJ. And your water bottle, too. they're also taking a full, plain water bottle. Um, and then for lunch, they're gonna have, uh, Nala has a, that one. Nala has a peanut butter sandwich, and then, well that's not gonna fit in there, but you can take it if you need to, okay? She's gonna make that happen. Um, Nala has a peanut butter sandwich cut out to look like a gingerbread man. If you want it to look a little bit more like a gingerbread man, I would suggest using wheat bread, but I want my kids to actually eat it, so we stuck with the regular bread that we always use. Um, I popped some creepy looking eyes on there, and then it looked funny without a mouth, so I just cut the rest of a little strawberry yeah, that we had left, and then we put some baby little mini M&Ms on there and stuck them on with peanut butter. And then we wanted him to look like he was kind of playing in the snow. So these are actually, um, these are actually Cheetos. These are the white Cheetos? cheddar or something. Yeah, and they have like the little snow shapes, so they look like little snowflakes. So I thought that'd be a fun little treat for them. And then um, Jaden's is the same, except his has, his has uh, some jelly on it and very little peanut butter because he's not a fan of peanut butter really. And then they're both going to step out of their little comfort zones a little bit. See, the kids kind of limit me a bit on what I can make because they won't eat it. So if you guys want some inspiration, you can always check out my Pinterest because I do pin a bunch of other ideas that I frankly just can't try on my kids because I know they're not going to eat it or it's going to be a struggle. And like I said, ultimately, I need them to eat something for lunch. So... Um, I decided to make these little reindeer, which they've both had celery, they've both eaten it before, so hopefully this goes over well. But I only made them two, and I just put peanut butter on the inside, a couple of little eyes, mm -hmm. and then I cracked some pretzels in order to make the antlers, and then um, just a couple of little Rudolph red noses there, made out of like, they're the little Hershey's candies. And then we made more Santa hats, but this time I uh, forego the grape. The grape makes them into like a Grinch hat, so <laughs> instead of that, um, we put the banana on, and, um, they just have three each here. So this is their lunch with the drink. And then they added apparently, oh, she replaced it. She took this out, out rather, and uh, she replaced it with a goldfish. So that is Wednesday. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Say bye. Only in the morning. <laughs> bye. After school Wednesday. Nala, why don't you eat the Cheeto thingies? What? Why don't you eat the snowflakes or whatever? You don't like them? They were moist? Oh, you know what? They did end up getting moist in there. Dang, another... Dang, it was just a sandwich, which, like, I really didn't expect that from a sandwich. Dang. Okay, that's okay. You ate the sandwich, though, the whole thing? Yeah. Oh, is it good? You ate all your Santa hats? And what about your reindeer? You did eat it, though? Yeah. Okay. Let's see. Like, you know how celery, you, try it. you know how celery, like you take a bite, there's still like those little lines. Mm -hmm. Those are all that was left on a little piece. Okay, and then throw that piece. stuff out, and this stuff too. She drank a little bit of her water today. Did you eat your snack? Mm -hmm. You had the animals and the goldfish. You ate it all. Throw that stuff out too, babe. I'm still hungry because I didn't get to eat. And then he had a little bit of his water. And about, he ate all the Cheetos. He was crying just now telling me he doesn't like peanut butter, so. 
he does like peanut butter. And he is gonna get this sandwich again. Not tomorrow, but he's gonna get it today. So he only ate an arm and a head, which was not quite half, I don't think. Um, and he didn't try these, which I specifically said he needed to at least attempt, and he didn't. You can tell he didn't even try at all. He didn't even pick them up or anything, so. I ate the um, then he ate most of them. I ate the pretzels off of both of them. You don't have to yell, girl. I, mommy, I ate the pretzels off of both of them, and I also ate the eyes. So the he ate a snack, and then you ate your snack, and then... Um, oh, and you're drinking your drink right now. All right, so we will see you guys. Uh, hey guys, uh, lunch on Thursday. We're gonna go super quick because we're a little late. So the kids are having um, Christmas tree cutouts with with uh, mini M&M little ornaments. Really simple. Jaden has peanut butter jelly. Nala has peanut butter peanut butter. And then, like I said, we're running late. So um, they're just gonna have these little prepackaged uh, apple and grapes on the side. They're also gonna do these little wintry Nutella and go with pretzel sticks. So that'll be their little crunchiness. And then and for their um, snack, not their snack, for their veggie today, Nella's taking snap peas with ranch, Jaden's taking carrots with ranch, and then I made these little baby penguins. Um, I would have put the cream cheese down the center, but I don't have regular cream cheese right now, and I don't wanna put pumpkin spice on them, but they're pretty cute when they're standing up, like, oh, hi, hi guys. Um, and then for their snack, yeah, I didn't put this in a container yet. Um, just one of these little like reindeer looking um, bagels again with the pumpkin spice cream cheese, and then they're taking this little organic applesauce with of course, a water analysis is playing today. We ran out of flavor, and then Jaden is having his one from yesterday, and he's having the same snack. So we'll see you guys later. All right, the kids just got back from school. Let's see what we got. Jay didn't really drink any of his drink. Not super surprising. He looks like he ate about half of his carrots. Let's see what's going on in here. Looks like he left his little penguins. Not cool, man. Oh, he didn't, did he even eat half the carrots? Not sure. Doesn't look like quite half. A little less than what he normally does. He told me I wasn't sending him with enough ranch. Um, he ate about half of the fruit. And then, again, about half. Maybe a little more than, no, about half of his sandwich. Right? How big was it? Yeah, this was probably about half. And then, he had plenty of ranch left, so I don't know what his thing was. We'll see if he wants to have that as a snack right now because he's upstairs at the moment. Now let's see what Nala rated. Oh, I feel like it's striking here. Let's turn the light on. Boop. Okay. Um, Nala didn't, did she even open it? I don't even think she opened her water. And then, ooh, she looks like she got into some things. She ate all her sandwich, all her fruit. And then she looks like she pretty much tore apart these little snap peas. And then she said, you told me I didn't have to eat the carrots, right? <laughs> I was like, yeah, you didn't have to eat the carrots. But she did eat the olives. So good on her. She did pretty good. And then they both ate their um, snacks. And I think, I think I'm about to clean this stuff up and then actually make them their lunch for tomorrow. Because they're going to go have a little sleepover with their cousins. Because um, I'm heading out of town in a couple of hours here. We are flying to London town. So, the kids have school tomorrow, um, and I asked them if they wanted hot lunch or cold lunch, and they said cold lunch, but I gotta make them something that will last, so like no sandwiches or anything, so I'll be right back as soon as I figure out what I'm gonna send them. Okay, so it's actually Thursday, but this is gonna be Friday's lunch. I had to make something that would be sustainable. Oh, I forgot to grab the milks. I'm gonna send them with two. Can you grab the milks? They're in the garage. Thank you, babe. Um, so this is a hot cocoa, cocoa puffs, so hot cocoa, cocoa puffs. Okay, I thought that would be like, you know, fun, festive. So basically the only difference is they have marshmallows in them. Um, anyway, the kid, the box is empty, the kids uh, got to eat them this week, so I thought that'd be like a fun little Friday treat. And then, um, thank you dear. And then Nala's gonna take snap peas as usual. I used the big containers because I thought this would fit, and it does. With the snap peas, it does work if I flip it over, but with the carrots, it doesn't work. So <laughs> I'm just gonna leave it on the side. I know. So the kids are gonna take these milks with um, with their cereal. They're gonna have that with their cereal. And then they are obviously still gonna have their veggie. I am foregoing the fruit because I don't have any fruit that I'm comfortable chopping up and stuff the day before. Um, but they're gonna take a Danimals, another little wintry Danimals. They both have one. This one's got snowballs, how cute. 
Uh, it hasn't really snowed here yet, but I'm waiting for it. And then they're each going to take a little disposable spoon. I'm trying to make this as easy as possible for, <laughs> for them. And um, they're going to their dance house this weekend, so I'm not going to get the lunch stuff back until Monday. So they're also going to take a little chewy snow day gingerbread spice granola bar again. They really like these, and they're super simple and easy for them, so... That's why I keep letting those, them take those. And then I thought it would be cute to use the little Santa containers again. So I'm going to close those up. And this has those um, snowflake like cheese puffs in it. And same thing in this one. Last time I had pirate booty in it. And then I bought these at Target. And I thought it would be a fun like end of the week treat to let them take these. So they're shaped like little Christmas trees. This is a milk chocolate with peppermint. Nala really likes peppermint. And then this is a white chocolate with birthday cake. Like birthday cake flavor. So... JJ's going to take that one. Um, and then I was going to send them with some of these because I got an edible arrangement with uh, strawberries like dipped in chocolate. But maybe I will and I won't tell them. <laughs> so I'll put that in a different container because Jaden just walked away. So um, that's Friday's lunch. This should last perfectly fine until tomorrow. I'm just going to have them put, in, put it in the fridge when I get to um, my parents' house because they're going to uh, watch the kids tonight to drop them off at the bus stop in the morning. So this is our holiday lunch week. And I hope you guys enjoyed it. Like I said, I was kind of limited in what I could do because the kids would only eat so many things. But um, maybe I'll do some more stuff next week and I'll film it again. And I'll do like some more because they still have a full week of school next week. So we'll see how that goes. Give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this. And that's all I got. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.